Welcome to DIY3DTech.com. In this episode of Bench Talk, I want to share a little bit of unboxing with something I got over here, which is really kind of cool. Because one of the pieces that I've done, and I don't know if you've seen it or not yet, but you will see it, is uh, I use these um, battery packs quite a bit. And, and actually, this is up on Thingiverse, and you'll see a video on it probably shortly. This will probably come out before that. But... Um, I use this battery pack for my cameras quite a bit. It's a 10,000 milliamp year battery pack, and it's got a 1 and a 2.1 uh, amp output. Now, one of the things in, you know, in the field and in the shop here, when you see a lot of the videos that I shoot at the machines, I actually use this screen right here to kind of frame up the camera because the camera kind of sits um, on a tripod and kind of away from where I'm at. And this is a 12 volt screen, but the problem is I've got to have a 12 volt power source coming to it and it kind of makes it kind of wanky. And so I'm utilizing this for everything else, then I got to have a 12 volt power source. So one of the things I wanted to find a way to get away from having a separate 12 volt power source and be able to go USB power for everything. And I found that and it's in this box and it's rather cool. Now, you might be saying, Joe, but I don't have a monitor. Why do I care? This is handy for any time you have a 12 volt, you know, rather low current, you know, because again, I'm, we're, we're putting out, you know, 2.1 amps at 5 volts here. So keep that at, in mind when you're, whatever you're going to run at 12 volts. But we have this guy here that can step up uh, 12 volts to, uh, or sorry, 5 volts to 12 volts. So kind of long story short, all I do is have to plug it in this battery pack. And ironically, and I, and I didn't know it when I ordered it, that it had a plug that matched it. Now it says positive center core, negative outer core, and basically I plug it in. Now there's no video going to it, as you can see, but it is powering it on. And this does work this. This is kind of really kind of cool because I can now use this 5-volt power supply to power a 12-volt um, device. The other interesting thing is this comes in a couple different form factors of output. So you can get this, and I'll have the links below with a cigarette lighter connector, as well as a 12 volt and 9 volt version where it switches between here. It has a switch to go 12, 12 or 9 volts to replace a 9 volt battery. Uh, so anyways, I think this is kind of a cool option to have if, you know, you have, like me, I've got a ton of these power banks because I use them for one of everything, especially, um, you know, out in the field and everything for my photography and, and things like that. Uh, or here in the shop for cameras and stuff because uh, all the cameras you see that I do time lapses on, I power them via USB banks just like this one or similar to this one. And, you know, because they have to run for hours doing time-lapse prints and the internal battery is not going to run that long so this is what I use it for so now I think this is actually a very cool addition and I can think of a thousand and one uses for it already so that's why I wanted to share it with you guys if you have a need to go from 5 volts to 12 volts this is the guy you know it's only like 10 bucks it was like super cheap because at first I thought okay I'm gonna go build something because one of the things that I wanted to be able to do is take this monitor to the field and I didn't want to have to drag another 12-volt battery with me. This solves that problem. So, anyways, hopefully you found this interesting. If you did, hey, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget Swag Shop is going to be up there. Subscribe. Do you got one of these? Let me know in the comments below what you use it for. Also, uh, what other things could I use this for that maybe I haven't thought of? Hit me up in the comments below, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers. Please click like below and subscribe to the channel.